this trace had to be very special, and um, it ha it's from the past, no? Mm -hmm. So I sought uh, an inspiration a little bit from the 20s, but it has to be for now, because she's wearing it now. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's all about uh, a, a wedding gown with simple lines, but with one extravagant detail in the back of the dress, which at the same time is a little bit uh, traditional because it has cover buttons, it's done in uh, crepe satin, it's, um, it's, really, it's really seductive, but it goes very well with her style. It's a wedding gown that I have designed. And uh, I usually treat my brides in the same way. They have to be very special. It's um, the most special day, or most important day in the life of a woman. So I try to do it in the same way. But this one, of course, is totally different <laughs> at the end. Because it's, it's a film, which is a cultural phenomenon, that you have to realize that millions of people are going to watch it. And uh, it had to be very precise. It had to be going very much with the whole story of the film, which is fascinating. And uh, I took in consideration all that, but I wanted to please the bride, because the bride is the most important for this scene on the film. And um, I work very specific for that. I use, in the dress, I use the crepe satin for the dress. And then I design the lace especially. The lace is especially designed for that dress, which is the extravagant detail in the back of the dress, which is a very important detail. The crepe satin it is not used usually. It was something that they used to use in the 20s, something like that. And um, it's very amusing because I use it for my daughter Patricia's wedding because she wanted something like very slinky and uh, in crepe satin. And then I, I, I thought it was fabulous for the occasion, for this one. And uh, the basis that she, she was very happy with it. 